up to nine years, three years at a time. The Goldman Prize so for the Environment was awarded to a South African, uh, Jonathan Deal. Deal has been recognized for his fight against hydraulic fracking in Karoo, a semi-desert region in South Africa, famous for its biodiversity and shale gas reserves. Oil companies, including Anglo-Dutch Shell, covered a surface of 240,000 square kilometers, roughly half the size of Karoo. The more that I have found out about the global fossil fuel industry, their history, their tactics, the way that they work, and where we are globally in terms of what fossil fuels mean to us, the more I felt compelled to stand up against it. Deal quickly became aware of the intentions of oil companies eager to extract gas using this new technique. It was then that he mobilized public opinion through social networks. Ecologists point out that fracking is harmful to the environment and to the water reserves of the region. An unfair fight motivates me and the sheer arrogance of the fossil fuel industry, especially in developing continents like Africa where they are used to buying and getting their way, um, really keeps me going. This determination did bear fruition. In 2011, environmentalists and landowners issued a moratorium on fracking, although this was lifted a year later. South Africa now awaits reports and surveys by experts to determine the viability of fracking.